the hell? Who's talking in the background? Oh no. There you go. Here we go. What's going on my fellow Z fighters? My name is Eviler Spartan. Welcome back to another episode of Dragon Ball Z Universe 2. Now, as you can see, I look pretty silly right now, but that's because I have half the suit. And this is called Frieza Suit. It's an outfit that you're able to get that makes you have and look like Frieza. It's a little skin or suit it says, but it looks like a skin. It's pretty cool. Hopefully, when I go finish this mission, I'll have the rest of the outfit. But what you want to do is go to Parallel Quest number 62. Freezes Nightmare Returns. Okay, so right here it says defeat Vegito and Gotenks. Defeat Gotenks before Vegito, which is one of the requirements and the winning conditions. And then defeat Super Vegito and Super Saiyan 3 Gotenks. So here are the drops. You get two chances of getting the outfit or the suit. It says Freeze the suit right there. And you get Teleporting Vanishing Ball, which is a pretty cool move. And hopefully I get that in this run. Alright guys, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you what Teleporting Vanishing Ball looks like real quick. get pretty up close and personal from a far distance all right let's get started so this mission isn't pretty hard you'll fight like Majin Buu, Super Buu and then Kid Buu and then Gotenks should come out and then Vegito and this mission is not too hard at all but stupid Buu is like running away from me come on oh this move I hate this move so bad come on let me get out get out get out so right now we're fighting Majin Buu and Super Buu and after you defeat these two guys then Kid Buu will appear not bad not bad at all almost dead oh no I thought I was for sure going to kill him. Keep there you go. Up. <clears throat> All right, now Super Boo. I'll kill you. No, stop running. <laughs> Dead. There you Not go. Sweet. There. I was hoping that was going to kill him. Alright, so now Kid Boo should be appearing pretty soon. Anytime. There you go. <laughs> <clears throat> and I think you fight Kid Boo twice. I'm not too sure. I don't remember. Oh, there you go. You get. You have to fight the little small Majin Boos. Now, I don't think these small boos have full health, but they have like a decent amount, and I don't know how much damage they do, but this part shouldn't be too hard at all. Just kill the small boos. I think there's like two or three, and then there's Kid Boo. Not bad! He's about to do a super on me or something. And he's dead. There you go. Perfect. Now it could be. What the hell is going on? Slowed him down. Now... Now, what I really wish they would have done in this game was, like, be able to transform Majin Buu into Evil Buu and then from Evil Buu to Super Buu and then be able to trans transform Super Buu into either Goku or Piccolo Absorbed or Gotenks Absorbed and then from there Gohan Absorbed. And I think, like, how the other Dragon Ball Z games or Dragon Ball games have came out where you could pick a character and max them out like 
for example, uh, cell, you could pick imperfect cell and then you could just level them up and each time you hit a different key level, he'd, uh, he'd become um, into his second form and then his perfect form and the super perfect cell and stuff like that. What? Same thing with uh, Gotenks or so Gohan and, or I mean, Goten and Trunks where in past games you're able to turn Super Saiyan and then the second transformation which was supposed to be a fusion you'd be able to fuse and then from there go to Super Saiyan 3 but I don't know why they didn't include that in this game I think it would have been pretty cool and then I I'd also noticed that they didn't include Zarbon's transformation which was pretty stupid in my opinion I like Zarbon's transformation it's a pretty cool mo move I guess for Zarbon in past games, I've used Zarbon just because, just so I could see him transform. It's, I think, in my opinion, I thought it was pretty cool seeing different characters transform from base to their ultimate forms and stuff like that. But they got rid of that, so it's kind of annoying. <clears throat> okay, once you finish Go Tanks, you get a warning sign, and he'll come back. Or Vegeta, there you go. Vegeta will turn Super Vegito, and then Go Tanks will come back, and then you have to defeat both of them. I think once you get Vegito's health down a specific amount, then Go Tanks Super Saiyan 3 will pop up. Thirty hit combo, sweet. There you go. Super Go Tanks, the Grim Reaper of Justice. <coughs> No. Oh, I hate when he does that move. No. Damn it. No match here. Try and do a final command on me on him. Come on. Tired already? What are you thinking? Watch out! There you go. Okay, let's see. Come on. Oh my God! Come on, dude. This is so stupid. Oh, I haven't even got Super Saiyan 3. I just noticed that. And of course, I ain't gonna be able to get up in time. This is so dumb. There we go. No way, how do you block that or dodge it? He shouldn't have gotten up that quick. <laughs> Who's talking in the background? Oh no. There you go. No, come on. Come on, Frieza, stop looking at me and freaking help me out. This guy. Let's try queer. Oh no. Come on, dude. Oh. This is so weird. The first time I did this mission, it didn't take me this long. Well, I don't remember actually. There you go. About freaking time. 
Now charge up all the way and finish off Gold Tinks, and that should be the last of the mission. Hopefully his health or his yeah, hopefully his health isn't too high. There's two of them fighting, but from the looks of it, they've been getting their ass whooped. Oh, never mind. There you go. Fuck yeah, <laughs> that was awesome. Z rank, heck yeah. You're seriously so I got his pants and the f boots and teleporting vanishing ball. Sweet. I got the complete set and the super move that you get. So there you have it guys. That's how you get Frieza's suit. And it's a pretty cool looking suit, I guess. If you if you're a Freezer race character, then I guess it'd be pretty cool to put Freezer's suit on and be pure white and then have a different head kind of thing and a tail going on. But that's pretty much it right there. Too bad this suit doesn't have the tail. But thanks for watching. Thanks for sticking around. Please leave a big thumbs up. It'll really mean a lot to me. And if you haven't shared this, please share it. And if you got any questions or any comments or any suggestions, leave them down in the comment section below. I'll be happy to answer them to the best of my abilities. Thank you so much for watching. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. And to my subscribers, I just want to give you a big thank you for sticking around and being so supportive and commenting every time you have a chance to but thanks for watching guys until next time